okay guys welcome back so today we're having a very huge meal as you can see so i've got my sensor on so i'm gonna have all this meal so that you can see how it will impact my glucose level so here actually it's fermented mango with some chili peppers the green and olive oil and the spinach it's baby spinach with salt and pepper and this is the steak salt and pepper as well and this is pap the pap here is cold works better with me when the pap is cold and pap is hot it, it raises my blood sugar very high so yeah let me chow this meal hello guys welcome back i ate pap i ate it yesterday at around four i didn't make the video after the three hours as i normally do i wanted to run throughout the night so that you can be able to see the overview the night up until now this morning as you can see up here if you look at the graph closely you will see that when i ate pap i was averaging at around 5.2 it then went up and then it peaked at 6.8 and then from 6.8 it went down again so what made the difference in that meal is that the pap was cold so the variability when you eat pap is cold the variability how quick it jumps a bit steady and again the pap at steak steak get fed that fat also buffered the carbohydrates which is in the pub so that helped as well there are a lot of research that are indicating that if you eat carbohydrates something like rice pub if you eat them cold they have got a lower impact on your glucose compared to when you eat them hot i've tried it with 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 many things i've tried, tried it with a potato the mashed potato I have tried it with rice, I've tried it with pap, it does work. So I will try those things on video as well so that you can be able to see them. So eating them carbohydrates that are cold is better compared to eating carbohydrates that are hot. So that's it guys. Thanks for watching and cheers. I'll see you in the next one.